Hi friends, exam selectivity channel like us welcome. Sanitary chemistry exam mock test part two. Chemistry in everyday life syllabus base is a total mock test on the mock test. Chemistry in everyday life and the topic le MCQ sign on the mock test on the mock test. And the part one class already says it under part one class on the other. E class on the other class on the other. Other words than a sanitary chemistry exam in the end of microbiologist exam in the end of common item mock test on the other. Previous question paper based to mock test. Then the microbiology in the one at the class on the other. Syllabus base is a total microscopy. Staining methods in the topic like questions on a mock test lad is in the sanitary chemistry in the syllabus and then the padikya on the topics on a apa questions like a on the padikya a syllabus like a topic base is a mock test like questions to prepare either in the for sanitary chemistry by the shade of the sanitary chemistry in the microbiologist in a common at the mock test to go on the on the padikya apa class on the other one angle a class and a class on the boy on the other sanitary chemistry in the part one class on Sanitary chemist, microbiologist, common mock test. Stand the class on the car. You can have a triangle for a car. Class is still like a car. Could the quarter class of the pattern of the channel subscribe you. I did show you which one of the following is employed as a tranquilizer. Options. Option A, naproxen. Option B, tetracycline. Option C, chlorpheniramine. Option D, equinal. Which one of the following is employed as a tranquilizer? Answer, equinal. Which one of the following is employed as a tranquilizer? Equinal. Extra points on gum and then a tranquilizers. Neurologically active drugs. These affect the message transfer mechanism from nerve to receptor. Tranquilizers are a class of chemical compounds used for the treatment of stress and mild or even severe mental diseases. These relieve anxiety, stress, irritability or excitement by inducing a sense of well-being. They form an essential component of sleeping pills. Let's go to the point. Tranquilizers, neurologically active drugs. This affect the message transfer mechanism from nerve to receptor. Tranquilizers are a class of chemical compounds used for the treatment of stress and mild or even severe mental diseases. This relieve anxiety, stress, irritability or excitement by inducing a sense of well-being. They form an essential component of sleeping pills. At that, we will talk about different tranquilizers in the pair. We will highlight it on the tranquilizers in the pair. Points on the chlordias epoxide and meprobamate are relatively mild tranquilizers suitable for relieving tension. Equanil is used in controlling depression and hypertension. Derivatives of barbituric acid. Example, veronal, amital, nembutal, luminal and seconal constitute an important class of tranquilizers. These derivatives are called barbituroids. Barbituroids are hypnotic, that is sleep producing agents. Some other substances used as tranquilizers are valium and serotonin. We will highlight this in the name of 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 the name. Investment Chlordias epoxide and meprobamate. Equanil, veronal, amital, nembutal, luminal, seconal, valium, serotonin. These are names of tranquilizers. Points on the other one. Chlordias epoxide and meprobamate. Relatively mild tranquilizers suitable for relieving tension. Equanil is used in controlling depression and hypertension. Derivatives of barbituric acid. These derivatives are called barbiturates. Veronal, Amital, Nembutal, Luminal and Seconal constitute an important class of tranquilizers. Barbiturates are hypnotic that is sleep producing agents. Barbiturates are derivatives of barbituric acid. Sample Veronal, Amital, Nembutal, Luminal, Seconal. Some other substances used as tranquilizers are Valium and Serotonin. At the Chodhyam, which statement is incorrect? Now the options are not under. लोरदाम तेट्टा है ना तेट्टा ऐड वाला गंडूडी क्या नाना चोदियाँ ऑप्शंस ऑप्शन ए ऑप्शन ए सम डिसइंफेक्टेंस कैन बी यूज्ड दस एंटीसेप्टिक्स एट लो कंसेंट्रेशन ऑप्शन बी सल्फर डाइसिन इस ए सिंथेटिक एंटीबैक्टीरियल ड्रग ऑप्शन सी एम्बिसिलिन इस ए नेचुरल एंटीबायोटिक ऑप्शन डी एस्प्रिन इस एनाल्जेसिक एंड 
which statement is incorrect? Incorrect ആയിട്ടുള്ള statement option C ആണ് Ampicillin is a natural antibiotic. Ampicillin is a natural antibiotic എന്നുള്ള statement തെറ്റായിട്ടുള്ള statement ആണ് അതിന്റെ correct form നോക്കാം Ampicillin is synthetic modification of penicillin. Ampicillin എന്ന് പറയുന്ന antibiotic Penicillin is a synthetic modification ആണ് Ampicillin ഒരു natural antibiotic അല്ല ആ തെറ്റായിട്ടുള്ള statement ആണ് Ampicillin is a natural antibiotic തെറ്റായിട്ടുള്ള statement ആണ് correct form Ampicillin is a synthetic modification of penicillin. അടുത്ത ചോദ്യം Barbituric acid and its derivatives are commonly called options. Option A and acids. Option B tranquilizers. Option C analgesics. Option D none of the above. Barbituric acid and its derivatives are commonly called tranquilizers. Barbituric acid and its derivatives are commonly called tranquilizers. We will answer the extra points in the next question. We will answer the extra points in the next question. ഈ ഒരു ക്വസ്റ്റൻ ആൻസർ പെട്ടെന്ന് തന്നെ കേട്ടോ അതുകൊണ്ടാണ് എക്സ്ട്രാ പോയിന്റ്സ് ഒക്കെ നന്നായിട്ട് പഠിക്കാന്ന് പറയുന്നത് ഈ എക്സ്ട്രാ പോയിന്റ്സ് വരുന്നതൊക്കെ പ്രീവിയസ് ഇയർ ചോദ്യപേപ്പിൾ ചോദിച്ചുള്ള ചോദ്യങ്ങളുടെ ഉത്തരങ്ങളാണ് നിങ്ങൾക്ക് എക്സ്ട്രാ പോയിന്റ്സ് ആയിട്ട് ആഡ് ചെയ്തിരിക്കുന്നത് എക്സ്ട്രാ പോയിന്റ്സ് ഒക്കെ നന്നായിട്ട് പഠിക്കുക ബാർബിറ്റിയോറിക് ആസിഡ് ആൻഡ് ഇറ്റ്സ് ഡെറിവേറ്റീവ്സ് ആർ കോമൺലി കോൾഡ് സ്ട്രാൻക്ലേസ് ആ ഡെറിവേറ്റീവ്സിന്റെ പേരും നന്നായിട്ട് പഠിക്കാം അടുത്ത ചോദ്യം ആസ്പിരിൻ ഈസ് ആൻഡ് അസറ്റലേഷൻ പ്രോഡക്ട് ഓഫ് ഓപ്ഷൻസ് ഓപ്ഷൻ എ എം ഹൈഡ്രോക്സി ബെൻസോയിക് ആസിഡ് ഓപ്ഷൻ ബി ഒ ഡൈ ഹൈഡ്രോക്സി ബെൻസീൻ Option C, O hydroxy benzoic acid. Option D, P dihydroxy benzene. Aspirin is an acetylation product of. Answer, O hydroxy benzoic acid. Aspirin is an acetylation product of O hydroxy benzoic acid. O hydroxy benzoic acid is an ortho hydroxy benzoic acid. Extra points on account. Aspirin is also known as acetyl salicylic acid, ASA. Very important point on account. Pala custom paper lim control a chodhu on account. Aspirin is also known as acetyl salicylic acid, ASA. Aspirin is prepared by chemical synthesis from salicylic acid through acetylation with acetic anhydride. O-hydroxy benzoic acid or ortho-hydroxy benzoic acid is salicylic acid. Ape vedu dhan tula. Aspirin is an acetylation product of orthohydroxy benzoic acid. This orthohydroxy benzoic acid is called salicylic acid. Aspirin is an acetylation product of salicylic acid or orthohydroxy benzoic acid. Orthohydroxy benzoic acid is called salicylic acid. If you have any point, you will have the option of orthohydroxy benzoic acid. If you have the option of salicylic acid, you will have the option of aspirin and acetyl salicylic acid. Orthohydroxy benzoic acid is Salicylic acid. Salicylic acid is also known as 2-hydroxy benzoic acid, 2-carboxyphenol. Extra points are okay. Now, I have to study here. Aspirin. Also known as acetyl salicylic acid, ASA. Aspirin is prepared by chemical synthesis from salicylic acid through acetylation with acetic anhydride. O-hydroxy benzoic acid. That means ortho-hydroxy benzoic acid is salicylic acid. For ortho-hydroxy benzoic acid, then that is salicylic acid. Option ले ortho hydroxy benzoic acid में वरम salicylic acid ना अन्ना लिम answer correct आना aspirin is an acetylation product of salicylic acid option ले वाना गिल ortho hydroxy benzoic acid में वरम salicylic acid आना दादरी किन्ह अंगल ये question का answer salicylic acid आना वरना द aspirin is an acetylation product of salicylic acid इन दो अंडर आना चल ortho hydroxy benzoic acid is salicylic acid salicylic acid is also known as two hydroxy benzoic acid टू कार्बोक्सी फीनॉल। एक्स्ट्रा पॉइंट्स हों का। एस्पिरिन ने कुछ लाइक एक्स्ट्रा पॉइंट्स आना। एस्पिरिन बिलोंग्स टू द क्लास ऑफ नॉन नार्कोटिक, नॉन एडिटिव एनालजेसिक्स। एनालजेसिक्स अंदर अंदर लोग तो हमारे पार्ट वन क्लास में पार्ट टू आया रहनु। पार्ट वन क्लास के एटॉर्क के इंदर एनालजेसिक्स ना गया एनालजेसिक्स ने कुछ सारे अंदर कमेंट जाएगा नंबर टास्क का ना एनालजेसिक्स से इंदर अंदर लोग तो नंबर अंदर कमेंट जाएगा पार्ट वन क्लास में एनालजेसिक्स इंदर ना डिटेल ऐड बार नहीं टोंडा रहनु ഫീവർക്കുന്നതിനാണ് അപ്പൊ ഫീവർ കുറയ്ക്കുന്നതിനാണ് അല്ലെങ്കിൽ റെഡ്യൂസിങ് ഫീവർ ആണ് ആന്റി പയറട്ടിക്സ് എന്ന് പറയുന്നത് അതുപോലെ അനാലിസിക്സിനും ഒരു പ്രത്യേകതയുണ്ട് അതൊക്കെ നമ്മൾ കഴിഞ്ഞ പാർട്ട് വൺ ക്ലാസ്സിൽ പറഞ്ഞതാണ് അപ്പൊ ക്ലാസ് കേട്ടുള്ളവർക്കാണെങ്കിൽ അനാലിസിക്സ് എന്താണെന്ന് അറിയാം അപ്പൊ അറിയാവുന്നവർ കമന്റ് ചെയ്യുക അനാലിസ് വാട്ട് ഇസ് അനാലിസിക്സ് 
Next point, because of its anti-blood clotting action, aspirin finds use in prevention of heart attack. Points on the wrong account. Aspirin belongs to the class of non-narcotic, non-addictive analgesic. Aspirin inhibits the synthesis of chemicals known as prostaglandins which stimulate inflammation in the tissue and cause pain. These drugs are effective in relieving skeletal pain such as that due to arthritis. These drugs have many other effects such as reducing fever, reducing fever, antipyretics. Antipyretics are those used for reducing fever and preventing platelet coagulation. Because of its anti-blood clotting action, aspirin finds use in prevention of heart attack. Which one of the following is employed as antihistamine? Abhi yaru topic in nangala paratimes nangandu analgesic, antipyretics, antihistamine, tranplacers. Thakka different classification on a classification nake nanayat padikya. Which one of the following is employed as antihistamine? Options. Option A. Chloramphenicol. Option D. Diphenylhydramine. Option C. Norethindrone. Option D. Omeprazole. Which one of the following is employed as antihistamine? Answer. Diphenylhydramine. Which one of the following is employed as antihistamine? Diphenylhydramine. Extra points all come. Antihistamines inhibit the action of the compound histamine which causes inflammation in the body. Histamine is responsible for the nasal congestion associated with common cold and allergic response to pollen. Synthetic drugs, bromfeniramine, dimtap, and terfenadine, seldane act as antihistamines. They interfere with the natural action of histamine by competing with histamine for binding sites of receptor where histamine exerts its effect. Points on the wrong account. Antihistamines inhibit the action of the compound histamine which causes inflammation in the body. Histamine is responsible for the nasal congestion associated with common cold and allergic responses to pollen. Synthetic drugs, bromfeniramine, dimtap, and terfenadine, seldane act as antihistamines. They interfere with the natural action of histamine by competing with the histamine for binding sites of receptor where histamine exerts its effect. Histamines in the example circuit on the tundra. Examples on the highly tail on the ring of the example circuit on the night of the Synthetic drugs, brown phenaramine, dim tap, and terfenade and seldane are antihistamines. Options on the ring of the matter compounds on the can now come. Chloramphenicol antibiotics, diphenylhydramine antihistamines. Norethindron, anti-fertility drugs, synthetic progesterone. Three and the Chodimal, Chodimal arguments like I'm not just kidding. Confusing and like questions are kind of the other classifications are not analgesics, antihistamines, and acids, tranplacers. Of the classifications are kind of not in a very confusing. I'm not in a very good class of the like ega, and I'll die primal parega. Put the classical pattern of the channel. Subscribe ega. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more videos.